Hi viewers, welcome to Gunjaya Shukur Java Interview Questions. Today in this video we will discuss about Spring Boot Interview Question. Okay, Spring Boot Interview Question. This is also one of the most famous interview question, and uh, you will also get some idea for doing card operation with the Spring combination of Spring Boot Data JPA and RESTful Services. Write Spring Boot Data JPA and REST API card operation coding. Like uh, get uh, post to put delete operations like. Uh, re re retrieving the record and create the record update record and delete record i hope you are already aware of this uh, this all these things but uh, combination of spring boot data jp and restful services i am explaining today in this video you will you will get to full clarity and this video what i am explaining what i am writing uh, write the code i will explain each and everything you will get the 100% clarity no uh, don't worry Okay, we will start uh, our discussion today. In this video, we, we will discuss about Spring Boot Data JP and RESTful Services combination of card operations. Like, uh, uh, we need to create one table with Spring Boot Data JP and uh, we need to retrieve the data and update, delete and uh, update and uh, create the record by using Spring Boot. Okay, we will uh, start our discussion. Create new Spring Boot Starter Project. Spring Boot SB means Spring Boot Data JP RESTful Services Coding. Okay, here I am taking Maven. Build tool I am taking Maven. Package type jar, language Java. Com dot. Okay, group ID. I am taking com dot app. Okay, Lambda I am taking Spring Web, Spring Boot Dev Tools, and Spring Data JP. Spring Data JP, Spring Boot Dev Tools, Spring Web, Lambda. For Lambda, I am taking for generating set target of methods. I am taking Lambda. When I am changing anything for restarting service purpose, uh, for my changes for restarting changes purpose, I am taking Spring Boot Dev Tools. For dealing with uh, JP repository interfaces purpose, I am taking Spring Boot Data JP for uh, Spring Web. Already you know very well about this. Next. Okay, completed. Do you wish to enable additional Java sources recognizing to get Spring session? Present not required. Okay. Open and pom dot XML. Okay. Here we will look into the 1.8 version Spring Boot Starter Data JPA. Spring Boot uh, Starter Web, Spring Boot Dev Tools, and Lambda Spring Boot uh, Starter State. This is related to testing, like uh, JNOT, like the uh, like the okay. All we are getting data JPA, Web and uh, Dev Tools, Lambda. Okay. Now SRC main Java. Well, I am first. I am creating some classes and packages. Calm dot after controller. One second. Okay. T R O L L R. Calm dot after controller. Product controller. P R O D U C T. Product controller. Calm dot after controller. Product controller. Finish. Here I am taking interface. Calm dot app dot service product service product service here service annotation is required okay com dot app dot I'm taking one class com dot app dot service service dot impl product service impl it is implements product service
this is the service uh, at the rate of service annotation is required and here also we will get at the rate of service annotation and one more com dot uh, we will take uh, one more repository com dot app dot repo com dot app dot repo product repo implement jpa repository okay and i am taking entity class also com dot app dot entity product and again i am taking dtwork class also com dot app dot dtwo here product dtwo com dot app dot dtwo product dtwo okay these are enough i am taking variables private integer id private private string name it will take nearly one hour time okay for the uh, completing this video it will take nearly one hour time private double price for generating setter getter mother plus i am using at the rate of data annotation enter again later taking i am taking entity class at the rate of entity by using at the rate of entity annotation we can represent our class as a entity class private integer id private string name for dtwo class variables and this class variables no need to same okay for uh, with uh, here this uh, entity class which is this it, with this variables name columns names will be created okay with this variables name column names will be created with this variable when we are calling the post request when we are calling the put request the request format match with these variables okay but uh, dto class variables and entity class entity class variables no need to same when we are sending the post request uh, put request we we are sending the with json format or xml format uh, xml format mm -hmm. those variables names and these variables name must be match that purpose we uh, we can take these variables but uh, entity class variables and dto class variables no need to match and no need to same okay and again here i am taking private double price for generating setter getter models i am using either the data annotation by default it will take class name as a table name and the variable name variable name it will take as a column name product repo what is our entity class name product what is our entity class name product enter what is our primary data type Pro what is our product class data type is integer sorry INTG GR integer. Or we mentioned that the rate of ID annotation that is also mandatory annotation. At the rate of ID annotation also mandatory annotation. Okay. Controller rest controller annotation is by seeing that the rate of rest controller annotation we can tell our application is distributed application. Okay. By seeing that the rate of rest controller annotation. we can tell our application is distributed application now i am okay i am minimizing minimizing here i am taking product service here public written by i am taking product option of pro product 
because of i will tell you that one also later option of product get product id semicolon control shift o java dot util dot optional get product it will take one parameter integer id okay actually if we are not sending the parameter it control yes okay get the product id with the name so okay, here we need to pass one parameter that is integer id okay and here public list of product get all product semicolon control shift o java dot util dot list okay this is entity class this is not dto class this is entity class because of we are getting the return type as a entity class not a dto type uh, return type we will not get as a dto return type we are getting request product this is uh, because of this is entity class that's why list of product entity class name this is okay later public string add product p r o d u c t product d t o p r d u c t product d t o product d t o control enter comma dot dot d t o again public string update product product d t o product d t o public string delete product integer id okay get product id one record get all product add product update product delete product integer id here implement here add unimplemented methods click on we get all implemented methods here product repo product repo repo i am taking semicolon at the rate auto where the annotation at the rate auto where the annotation okay here i am taking if the id is present if, if condition actually if you are repo dot repo dot exist exist by id if the id is present okay if the id is present then only we will if the id is present then only we will retrieve the data what is exist by id is predefined method what is written type here boolean for that i am taking if condition okay for that i am taking if condition if the id is present then only return repo dot find by id okay method name find by id parameter is integer parameter return type is optional for that purpose for that purpose i taken as a return type as return type i taken as a optional optional okay here this is predefined method okay parameter is one parameter return type is optional product this is entity class name okay that's why i taken return type as a product this is our entity class name it is not possible to take product dto okay we need to do, do the operation with entity class only we need to take the we need to do the operation with entity class name only that's why 
here our return type is optional of product we should take uh, here also return type as a optional of product that's why i taken here optional of product i hope you got the clarity this is this is entity entity class name okay else return you null okay this one is completed here also return directly directly we can return here repo dot repo dot find all repo dot find all method semicolon okay directly it will return the data narrator here also this is the add product this is add product here i am taking repo dot save method i am taking here save method okay save method suppose p r o d u c t product d t o repo dot save method of product d t o if i take this product d actually from end user to we will get to like uh, id is equal to 101 name is equal to like uh, name is equal bag price is equal 500 like that uh, we will get the object data here from end user but uh, if i if i pass here we are getting the error because of it will take entity class object if it, it will not take user object to reference it will take entity entity class object only what is your entity class name product product p is equal to new product okay from here object data is available like id is equal to something name is equal to something price is equal to something that, that data is available here with object format we need to take that data like uh, p dot p dot set id of get id method similarly p dot set name p dot set name of product dto dot get name method similarly p dot set price p dot set price of product dto dot get price okay now we will pass entity class reference only we will pass here entity class reference only okay we will if you pass this object reference we will get error because of report that some relation is uh, like uh, jp repository okay this we need to pass entity class re reference only that's why i am taking entity class reference i hope you got the clarity again he here repo repo dot exist by id repo dot exist by id of product dto dot get id method if the id is present then only exist by id is written type is if condition uh, like boolean if for like i am for that i am taking if condition okay if the id is present return return product id already available actually if the id is present we, we need to we no need to send the object we need we no need to save the object if the id is not present if the id is not present do report dot save of p report dot save of p return custom message like uh, product added a d d a d d e d successfully okay, we can remove this one okay if the id is present to 
no need to add product product we need to send the message product id are all available if the id is not present then only report are save okay for post request also nearly same okay update like uh, put request for put request also updating data also nearly code is same but here if the id is present then only we need to do here if the id is present then only update the data here we need to send product updated product updated successfully otherwise product id is not available okay otherwise If the ID is present, then only product I updated successfully. Otherwise, product ID not available. Okay, for deleting request also same. If of report dot exist by ID of ID. If the ID is present, then only report dot delete by ID. of id return otherwise return product id not available okay if the id is present then only report dot delete by id is id like product id product deleted successfully otherwise product id not available our service implementation logic is completed okay next product controller here product service this object implementation class object is created by using at the top of annotation okay here public optional of product get product id of integer id okay here at the rate of path variable annotation at the rate of get mapping value is equal double quotes slash id and open brace again slash open brace close brace and id comma get uh, uh, get type request doesn't contain body that's why no need to write consumes yeah, yeah i'm taking producers is equal to application slash json comma double quotes application slash xml okay here here uh, uh, for custom message purpose also we can use response entity response entity class we can use for sending custom code 
for the casting code purpose we can use this one response response entity okay service dot get prot id of id semicolon control 1 enter for getting the return type okay return return new response entity entity of what is here we need to send a this one comma http status code dot ok semicolon ok this one is completed for get all all method also nearly same but uh, here parameters are not there here sorry here we can take uh, get slash id open brace why it is blinking id comma okay here get all get all here parameter is not required get all products Here parameter is not required. Here a return type also different. The staff, we will get the rest of return type. Response T of We will get to here list of product. Control shift go Java dot util dot list. Here also we will get the return type as control one enter. Here are product our product here list of product here add product add product uh, okay get all product okay okay next uh, next uh, is post public string add product we can take uh, request body product dto product dto 
ओके हियर सर्विस डॉट एड प्रोडक्ट ऑफ प्रोडक्ट डी टी ओ हियर वी कैन टेक पोस्ट रिक्वेस्ट पोस्ट मैपिंग ऑफ वैल्यू इज इ कोल्ड स्लैश एड प्रोडक्ट consumes is equal application slash json comma application slash xml Put is also same. Copy and paste. Here add product to and product D T O. Product D T O. Control one enter for custom response. response entity of string i am using stri ng yum it is blinking like this the mistakes are Yeah, 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 the problem is removed. You add the product. Okay, here you add the product of a right of request body. IQEST request body of product DTO, product DTO, response on TF. Okay, here we can remove this one, these things. Control one, enter now. Return new response entity of return new response entity of string of here add the product comma HTTP status dot HTTP status dot okay now. Okay, post request it will take in uh, it will support consume means it will uh, support input as an application JSON and XML format and the producer solid it will support uh, JSON and XML format. Add product to productive productive put request also nearly same slash product okay put request also nearly same but here you can update product we can write here update product and here also we can take service dot update product okay here also we can take update here also we can take update product here in post request here response type we can send as created Cre created means it we will get response code as 201 okay here, here also we can here, here it is showing 201 means status code as created created means row is created successfully update product to 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 letter public string delete product of integer 
आई डी इंटीजर आई डी टाइप इज एट द रेट ऑफ पाथ वेरिएबल ओके ये ओपन ब्रेस एंड क्लोज ब्रेस मैपिंग टाइप इज डिलीट रिक्वेस्ट डिलीट मैपिंग डिलीट मैपिंग ऑफ डबल कोड स्लैश डिलीट स्लैश ओपन ब्रेस क्लोज ब्रेस एंड आई डी यर सर्विस डॉट डिलीट प्रोट आई डी ऑफ आई डी सेमी कॉल इयर आल्सो यू कैन टेक रेस्पॉन्स एंटिटी रेस्पॉन्स एंटिटी ऑफ स्ट्रिंग रेस्पॉन्स एंटिटी ऑफ स्ट्रिंग रिटर्न न्यू रेस्पॉन्स एंटिटी ऑफ डिलीट प्रोडक्ट कम एच टी पी स्टेटस डॉट ओके सेमी कॉल ओके आई होप ऑल आर क्लियर वेरी एवरीथिंग रिट्राइव बाय आई डी रिट्राइव ऑल एड अपडेट डिलीट एवरीथिंग वेट सक्सेसफुली ओके सर्विस आई एम पी एल सर्विस रेट ऑफ सर्विस प्रोडक्ट रिपो दिस इज एंटी एंड डेटी वन नाउ यू आर रनिंग वी विल रन दिस वन अप्लीकेशन स्प्रिंग बुट अप्लीकेशन रन इट इज रनिंग Fail it to configure a data source URL. I hope this we will we got this error for. We need to add. We need to add a MySQL connector. We need to add MySQL connector in Pomodoro XML. Spring Boot Data JPI. Control S. If you remove this version ID, Spring Boot according to Spring Boot version related to jar it will be downloaded. It is related to version it will download by default. If you are not writing the MySQL connector jar version, okay. I hope we will run again. Run as Spring Boot application. Run as Spring Boot application. In formatted XML also, we, no, we are not uh, uploaded. Uh, we are not writing this one. That's why you got error. I already, I have these things also. Control yes, update. If the table is created, then it is. Uh, it create means if the table is not uh, available, it will create. Otherwise, it will update the. Table, okay. I'm running again. Run as Spring Boot application. Okay. No, 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 uh, no worry. We will resolve the error also. What is the error we got here? Ambiguity problems. Can I add to product control? Product controller. In product controller, we got ambiguity problems. Maybe URL name is same. Product controller. I think post request and the put request we did the copy paste. Maybe there we can get the problem. That is post request. This is put request. This is put mapping. Update here also update product. Delete port mapping and post mapping, and get mapping, get no mapping. Okay. With the errors also, we will get some idea. Sometimes, if you do the copy paste, you will not get full copy data and subject.
we'll check what what is our uh, database name what is our database name here gunji okay here use gunji okay select a star from show tables i will use show tables product i will drop this one drop the table product okay drop the table product i will use show i will run again i'll stop the server i'm running again table is created we will check whether the table is available or not show tables table is available select a star from product i rename price okay table is created successfully now we will check the we will check with the post request because of that we need to send the data okay http colon double slash local host by default it will takes port number 8080 slash in post request what is product controller post request what is url typing add product add r o d u c t okay add product body ra and here jason open brace and close brace here actually here in the post requesting we are writing id is equal to something name is equal to something and price is something we are sending the request so that request that request comes to here that request comes to through this url we will get the through here we will get the data here we will get the data as a product dtb in object format it will be stored because of here id is equal to something like id is equal to 101 uh, name is equal to like uh, name is equal to bag price is equal to 500 like that we will get a java object format we will store the data here here in object format we will save the data here from url in product dtb in product in product dtb id name same what are the names we will give uh, we we mentioned here those names we would give we should give here okay we must give here id colon 101 comma okay what is the name name colon double quotes like what is the name i am mentioning bag comma double quotes price price i am mentioning 500.00 i am sending request here product added successfully product added successfully through as a object format as a object format here as a object format data will come here okay what is the in product dtb what is the variable you mentioned those variable should be must be match here id name same id name price here also as object format like id is equal to 101 name is equal to bag price is equal to find it like uh, through object format data will be stored here from here we will call we will call here from here from here it will go to the implementation class it, like as object format we will we will get the data here okay but here if you do the save operation it will take object entity class it will take entity reference as a reference it will take that's why through setter getter methods through setter getter methods we are getting the data from here we are getting the data from here we are getting the data we are uh, set id set id set name set price we set the data by using prod dtb dot get id prod dtb dot get name prod dtb dot get price like that we are doing the operation here i hope you got the clarity okay i hope you got the clarity we will do again suppose if i try again here product id product id already available okay now 102 we have 
पेन पेन इज फिफ्टी रुपी ऐ एम से रिक्वेस्ट प्रोडक्ट आडेड सक्सेस्फुली ना वन जीरो थ्री वन जीरो थ्री हियर ऐ एम रईटिंग पेनसी फिफ्टीन रुपी ओके वन जीरो थ्री ऐ एम से रिक्वेस्ट प्रोडक्ट आडेड सक्सेस्फुली वी वी विल अबर्व हियर वेदर द डेटा इज कमिंग आर नाट सेलेक्ट स्टार फ्रम प्रोडक्ट ओके वन जीरो वन बैक फाइव हंड्रेड वन जीरो टू पेन फिफ्टी रुपी वन जीरो थ्री पेनसी फिफ्टीन रुपी वी गैट द डेटा हियर ओके अगेन वन जीरो फोर वन जीरो फोर बुक्स बुक्स हियर फिफ्टीन हंड्रेड सेंडिंग रिक्वेस्ट प्रोटेड If I try to with same ID, if I try to add again, we get the error. Product ID already is available. Okay, here pro one zero five. One zero five. I am writing here. Social book. Four hundred. Social book is four hundred. ID number. ID number five. One zero five. Product added successful. Okay. Suppose. With post request, I will modify the data. I am trying to modify the data. What is the URL here? Product controller. What is the URL here? Update product. Update product. Okay. In the update product, this is the URL. Update product. Update product. Suppose I will make this one science book. Otherwise, I will make math math book. Math book price is fourteen hundred. Okay, here what is the data here? One zero four is social book four hundred. Okay, here one zero five. One zero five social book four hundred. I will make that one one zero five math book. Math book four hundred. here put request 405 405 means method not allowed actually that is put request but i am trying with post request that's why i got method not allowed 405 i am sending request again product updated successfully we will check here okay we will check here math book 400 data is changed okay data is changed ओके डेटा इज चेंज रेस्पास् को वी गाट टू हंड्रेड रेस्पास् को वी गाट टू हंड्रेड पोस्ट रिक्वेस्ट बॉडी जेसन सॉरी हियर Control C. Here, uh, I will create another record. One zero six. English book. I will make this one as three hundred. Okay. Post trick four zero five here. Add product. Now we will get a st here status score is two hundred. Two sorry status score is two zero one. Why we got uh, actually for creating purpose we we got two uh, zero one. Suppose I need to change. I need to change two zero three. The post mapping. No content. No content is two zero four. Sorry. I need to change two zero four. Why we are why we are using response entity? Now you you will get the clarity. Okay. Now you will get the clarity. I will I will make this one one zero seven, okay. 
टू जीरो फोर फॉर सेंडिंग कस्टम रेस्पॉन्स कोड पर पास वी कैन यूज रेस्पॉन्स एंटिटी ओके अदरवाइज एक्चुअली काम फॉर क्रिएटिंग पर्पस कामन वी विल गेट टू जीरो वन सपोज विथ रेस्पॉन्स एंटिटी आई चेंज टू टू जीरो फोर ओके आई होप फॉर दिस आल्सो यू गार द क्लैरिटी अगेन नाउ वी विल ट्राई विथ गेट रिक्वेस्ट एच टी पी कॉलन डबल स्लैश लोकल होस्ट कॉलन एट जीरो एट जीरो स्लैश गेट स्लैश वन जीरो वन वी विल गेट स्पेसिफिक रिकॉर्ड वन जीरो वन इफ यू वॉन्ट वन जीरो टू रिकॉर्ड वन जीरो गाट वन जीरो टू रिकॉर्ड आलो वन जीरो थ्री ओके वन जीरो फोर लाइक दैट वी विल गेट द रेस्पॉन्स हियर स्पेसिफिक रिकॉर्ड If you want all the records, all the records get all, get all. One zero one two three four five six seven. Jason formats we will get to open brace and close close brace on the arm. Suppose suppose actually, I, if I want to uh, Excel XML format, okay? For I want XML format. Except, except, except. Okay, except is equal to application slash XML. Internal server error. Actually. Internal server error. Hello. 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 We need to remove this one. Hello. Producers get request. Application JSON application slash XML. Get all. ओके वी लुक इन टू दिस यशो यशो अगेन वो गेट आल आलो यू गट गेट आल नेक्स्ट डिलीट रिक्वेस्ट वी लुक इन टू द डिलीट रिक्वेस्ट ओके वी लुक इन टू द डिलीट रिक्वेस्ट वेदर दिस इज वर्किंग आर नॉट डिलीट एच टी पी कॉलन डबल स्लैश डिलीट डी एल टी डिलीट वी लुक इन दिस रिकॉर्ड How many records are there? Suppose I need to delete one zero seven record. One zero seven record slash one zero seven. Okay. Product deleted successfully. Here it is. Here one zero seven is available. Okay. Now one zero seven is not available. This is deleted. I will try. Product ID is not available. If I try with the wrong uh, ID, product ID is not available. I will try with the one zero six. One zero six here it is available. I am sending request here. Send product deleted successfully. If I try with the again product ID is not available. One zero six it is available. I will try again. One zero six is not available. Okay. We tried with the get to get all post put delete request. i hope you got the clarity if you have any doubts please comment in this video i will clarify i will try to clarify your doubts whether you understand or not properly or not i hope i will, i uh, i gave full clarity to you if we have any queries please comment in this video your opinion we tried with to uh, get to post put delete all, all the requests okay I hope you got the clarity if you have any doubt please comment in this video thanks for watching bye we will meet in next video